Well, meantime, nearer the scene of that attack in Woolwich itself, there has been a protest tonight by members of the English Defence League. Their leader, Tommy Robinson, said he's a, among a group of about 250 men. They're chopping our soldiers' heads off. This is Islam. That's what we've seen today. Well, Sky's Alistair Bunkle has been down there witnessing it. Um, what have you seen, Alistair? Well, Anna, it's pretty much all over now. Uh, I should say first up, the police asked the English Defence League to disperse and presumably feeling that they'd made their point, uh, they obliged and uh, almost as soon as it started, uh, it was over. But for a point, it did get pretty tense. There was a couple of hundred of them probably gathered uh, in a pub first off in the evening uh, to protest against the attack that happened close by here earlier on this afternoon. They were, some of them wearing balaclavas, they were chanting and at point throwing glass bottles and uh, having running battles with the police. But it remained a tense atmosphere for most of the evening. It didn't really ever get extremely violent and the periods where it was getting out of control lasted probably for about half an hour or an hour before the police reinforced and managed to contain the situation. Alistair, live there. Thank you very much. For the latest pictures you can see, despite the fact that Alistair says this is largely over, uh, scores of English Defence League supporters making their feelings known, as you can see.